This is the final demonstration video of Project Sugarcube where we'll be showing how to implement a marker-based augmented reality system using the Oculus Rift and the Leap Motion Controller. In one of our previous videos, we've shown how to put the camera feed inside the Oculus Rift and a video after that, we've shown how you can interact with virtual objects using the Leap while wearing the lift, Rift. And now we'll show you how you can do marker-based tracking with the same. We're trying to mimic the properties of a hologram using the lift. And now as you can see, you can see a spinning cube which maintains its position on the table. With respect to the marker. So as you move around, as we look around the marker, you see different aspects of the cube that's rotating over here. And uh, what we've done is, with the leap motion over there, you can put your hand over it and that changes the velocity of the cube. So as you can see, you see different aspects of it. You can go closer or further away from the queue depending on where the camera is based on respect, uh, with, uh, with, respect to the cam with respect to the marker. Now if you could replace this cube with other models such as this hard, 3D rendered hard. This of course we got again from Blendswap. So now once we lowered a model, any 3D object onto this, we can control it using the leap with palm orientation and we can change our view of this object. So again, we can see different aspects of it by actually looking around it or by using the leap to rotate it. So right now, we're just turning our palm, or we're just turning a palm over the leap and that allows us to look at different aspects of the heart. Apart from this, we can also just turn around, that is look around the marker and see different aspects of the heart as though it is uh, because it maintains its position with respect to the marker. So as long as the ma uh, marker stays in your field of vision, you can see different aspects of the object rendered on top of it. This is our final demo for Project Sugar Cube, and this is uh, the interface that we were talking about that we want to implement. That is, uh, create objects over markers that mimic the properties of a hologram. So this object can be manipulated, and it is massless, and it maintains its position like a real object with respect to the marker. Thank you.